dear friend nowadays racing bar or video graph or ranking graph is most important on youtube there are so much channel they are earning so much views so much income just by showing video graph data rank like you can show like coronavirus death graph or any product selling graph or ranking of any video games or top countries selling or any uh, any population data or anything you can show on youtube and you can earn use money so in this video i'll show you how to make those graph a to z about those graph how to how to make it visualization how to uh, customize it how to uh, save it how to make it as a video format and how to collect your information uh, country flag icon all those things you can see in my tutorial so to make data you have to go to a site and remember all those website I'm gonna talking about in this tutorial I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna put this put those websites links on my video description you can find it there so to create a data I mean video graphs or ranking bars you have to go to a site the site address is app.flourish.studio just find it on my video description link so after coming here uh, you have to uh, you have to log in or make uh, you have to sign up here just click a sign up and you will find a login button with your Google or Facebook or manually with your email ID so I'm gonna log in with my Gmail account because I have previously signed up here so I have created some random data let's click on of those data after coming here you can see two tab here like preview tab and data tab and in this data tab you can modify your data like you can see the left most left bar column this is my uh, country name it can be your any product or any countries like any apps name the data you want to show this is the main point main column your label column I'm in this in this preview or in this graph I'm just showing the coronavirus death graph uh, can date wise like one March which country was top and which country was lowest and and it's it's cool and it's going up and down because it's changing the data data wise and it's changing showing the data so you can see the my first column is country name second column is my image url actually it's not sh showing the image because i not uh, i have not shown or fixed my image column my image column is you can see b and it's showing the C and if I change it to B okay now on click on preview now you can see it's uh, showing our country flag icon so this column is just my flag icon you can you can put it anywhere but you have to show it here like yeah it's it's my image column it's my level column I mean country column and it's my main data D to Z Z D to Z Z not it's a start from C yeah from c to zz column will be my main data so by this way you can change it from here if you want like uh, you can change it but if you have uh, any uh, data on your computer you can just upload it from there you can say i have my data from here i i just uploaded it from here so you can upload it now uh, in in the in the end of this video i'll show you how to how you can inf collect this information and this country flag where you can from but let's work with this like like change this color or icon or anything just let's uh, introduce yourself with these things if you go to data you'll find just uh, you have to select your data row column it's normal just you can see select it from here you can change it from here <laughs> now all I'm gonna do I'm gonna customize my graph number one first one is graph style it can be now it's in horizontal mode you can change it to vertical you know so and you can fix the bar numbers right now it's showing the only 10 countries graph you can you can modify it by here if you make it more they will show more data 
and if you want to see in the large scale you have to click this uh, full screen preview then you, you can see it in full screen preview okay you can show in mobile version or computer version or anything so let's check another things now you can see fill a space like if you click this it will fill the blank space and if you specify the any size height then it 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 will it will modify as you mentioned in height fill space is good now now shorting you can show it from highest wise or lowest wise you just check those things it's not possible for me to uh, to check all those things to show you all those things it's normal and it's very easy you can work with that and you, you'll find everything useful and handy so i'm gonna show you just most important things now bar color if you have uh, like category if you make a category column like albania algeria this is for asia or this is for europe or any other country you can make it categories wise and you, you can show your category column here and that way if you make it category wise your color will be category just asia will be the same color europe will be the same color america will be the same color and if you send it by single like all those things will be single and by bar like every bar will be individual different color and not only this you can change your color plate from here like it will change the color plate or you can make your custom color from here editor plate icon like you can if you know how to change it like if you may want to make it black make make it white default left you know to this you know you need to know the color code if you change it want to change it manually now bar color opacity it should be one is good like full color or you can lazy it or make it like blur or something now labels label is something like um, your country name the left things here you can change this font size like in now right now it's black color you can change it to red or something let's change it to red you can see it now it's red and you can make the space between from left side like it will move to right and you can work with those things and uh, you can change it sense it to back uh, black color and image and uh, I mean country flag and uh, the country name position you can change from here like right now it's label in the left and country flag in the right if you change it to this you can see it will uh, goes alternately like uh, country flags will be from left and country name will be from right I think that was good and image like uh, image size country flag size you can change the height or width or you can uh, like f it will automatically fit your position and uh, you can change it to rectangular or uh, like now you can see it's rectangular and it's now in circle now let's change it to 10 because it will looks good okay only 10 countries will show here now timeline and total like all those total size they will automatically automatically sum all those data and they will show you total like here total you can change it like um, total date you can see uh, it's changed to total date and you can select it color to you know, let's say it to yellow and date and date wise you can change it also and caption if you want to put any caption here I mean uh, let's change it to axis you can change this axis color it's now this color you can change it make it to red you can see it's changing to may red color and timeline is something like how how long it will be play like you can it's just for 30 seconds if you make it it will play for 60 seconds and it will go uh, um, slowly and you can change the animation, uh, animation time of your bar changing up and down time and you can put uh, header like um, if, you, if, you, if you want to write something about your title you can write like uh, coronavirus total 
death hit enter you can see it's showing your uh, title here and you can change it to change its border like bottom yeah, it's bottom border and you can change in the middle or left side it's in the middle and can, you can also change it color like uh, like green or something no it's uh, border color if you want to change its color um, yeah so yeah from here you have to click this uh, styling button then you can change it to green yeah now it's green and you can you can increase this font size or yeah, like padding size or anything and similarly in in the footer you can set in you any logo if you have or you can put any note here and you can alignment the text so it's cool i think you will you will get everything figured out once you use it and now i'm going to show you how you can record it just just uh, to make it as a video format you can export it as html or if you want to record it in uh, i mean video format all you have to do you need to software like uh, right now i'm using obs recording software by this recording software it's totally free and it's recording hd mode you know you can see it's recording all you have to do is just go to uh, full screen mode and you can um, click f11 to go full screen in browser f11 you can see right now full screen and now if you go to if you start recording and if you stop recording then you can record hold those things and you can upload on youtube now i'm going to show you where you can collect your information like this all this data actually there are so many uh, website they are giving you this kind of free data you can search i know i hope you know how to search on google but i'm gonna uh, put some link on my video description where you can find this information and where you can find countries you know, image actually not <coughs> you can collect it from anywhere like if you search or no um, uh, search on google india flag then it, if you collect any image from here and right click on it and copy image address and if you put it here if you paste it here so it will show that image this image on the on your you know, on your as a country flag so it's very hard this way to collect all this information you you are simply you can go to countryflags.io in this website you can find all countries images just right click on it and copy miss address and put it to your data table also uh, i have a sheet all countries flag sheet i have excel sheet i'm gonna put my download link on my video description you can download it from here so this way if you have enough time you can show your any graph like uh, dead graph of coronavirus affected graph any country's population data and any selling data or anything that you, if you have any creativity you can show anything and you can earn huge money just from youtube by this way so i think you find this video helpful if you have any question just ask me in the comment section i'll try to answer the answer your question and if you are new in my channel please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get more updates so always stay with us and stay home and stay safe. Take care.